we have Bitcoin pushing that 50K level right now, $50,000. Things are just going in nuts, like nuts. I just had to do this impromptu live stream. We, 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 like we were just above $50,000. That's just crazy right there. We did talk earlier in the live stream about potentially having a pullback. So just keep your eye on that. I mean, things are actually looking like they were making higher lows, you know, compared to the lower highs. So that is de like, is definitely looking good. This is the first time doing a live stream on my phone. So I'm not sure how I can see the chat. We shall see. This is like a learning opportunity. Cool. Everything looks good there. Cool. That looks good. Okay. I assume everything's working fine. I assume everything's wor working fine. So that's good. Bam. So cool. So just, just like, just try, like checking things out, just doing a quick impromptu live stream on the phone, just seeing how this works. First time doing this. So how do you guys like these like a little different? You guys definitely want to see the screen or like, is this cool? It's just like, just sitting back looking, I mean, like Bitcoin pushing the 50 K it's pretty cool to see. It's pretty cool to see that happen. I mean, I was messing around with uh, some Fibonacci's, the like the Fib tool, and it's pretty cool to see that we did come right above like the 50k things are looking mighty fine if you guys are just tuning in you guys might send the chats and curious how it looks on the phone do doing a live stream this way uh just testing it out seeing you know do you guys prefer the like with the screeners just the mobile way cool so cancel it hopefully we're good okay and like anyways it's like Bringing up the graph, I mean, we have Bitcoin about to make all-time high. The graph down at 192 on the daily here. Uh, let's zoom out a little bit. I mean, that daily candle, wow, that daily candle closed down. Uh, okay, okay. Um, yeah, we want to see the graph. It, it, like, it's just correcting right now. We may see it eventually fall down a little bit further, but hey. Just means a good buying opportunity, right, homies? Just a good buying opportunity. Yeah, wouldn't be surprised to see it bounce off the 163 region or possibly, I mean, if we could first hold the 187, that would be great. Of course, that would be great. Hey, guys, you just tuned in. How do you guys like this type of a live stream? I know this is completely different, completely different. Oh, cool. So, okay, cool, cool. Draft Boss, what is going on? Thank you guys so much for tuning in. It's pretty cool how it's very different when it's on mobile, very different. Um, it kind of be cool if I could show my chart at the same time. I'm not sure if that's possible. How low can it go? What uh, what coin? How low can what coin go? Damn. This is awesome. Hey, thank you so much. This is the first time do like doing it this way. So I, I mean, like you just had me talking, but I'm checking the charts out right here. BTC is going through the roof today. <laughs> I know, man. I know. I was just I was literally just doing some analysis on the graph and look at what's going on. Ooh, the chat just went away. Why? Cool. Okay. It's back there. Check Badger and PBR from DJ Mike. Hey guys, what is going on? If he drops to 1K, I'm buying big. <laughs> I love it. I love it. So Badger and PBR, PBR. Do you guys prefer when I share this screen? Because I mean, this is completely different than uh, than normal. Just trying to get some feedback. So Polka Bridge. Oh yeah, Polka Bridge. Anything Polka Dot seems to be doing mighty fine. Joe, what is going on? Sup, homie? So nice to see you guys in the house. We have Pokebridge PBR. It seems like it'd be a decent uh, project. I mean, $16 million mark cap. It's under the Polkadot Foundation. I mean, Polkadot is a big deal. Polkadot is definitely a big deal. Cool, the chat stays there. Yeah, 53 cents up, up a little bit. Where can you get PBR? Swap or Black Sari. Cool. GRT is 198. Eli, you looking a little down, my homie. Looking a little down. James says, homie, back again. Hey, so nice to see you guys here. We're, we're doing a different type of live stream. But yeah, GRT is down a little bit. But, but with Poker Starter, so this is the first decentralized bridge between Polkadot platform and other blockchains. That right there is pretty big. That right there sounds pretty big right there. Seeing the, uh, being able to integrate with other blockchains, of course. You know, the graph is not integrated with it. it. Sounds like the rumors were Avalanche. The rumors were it was Avalanche, Binance Smart Chain, and there's a bunch of other ones that they're they're considering. They're considering. So that's pretty cool as well. 
So, and that is what's up. So what do you guys think of these live streams like this? This is completely new, completely just impromptu. I saw Bitcoin um, making all, like all time high, so I had to do something. I figured, cool. Do you guys prefer when you guys see the screen? I, I feel like you, you guys probably do, but I just figure I you know want to all, like offer it out there. You says uh, Javon. You said DRT is holding pretty well. What up, homie? What's up? I like it. You like this kind of awesome. crypto military? What up? Your head is so big on the screen, crazy. Yeah, I know. I have it this way. It definitely is big. Um, <laughs> just got massive head, bro. <laughs> uh, show the screen. So like right now, I don't think I can because I'm uh, I'm using my phone. I just want to try something completely different. See how it works out. How is how is ETH still down? <laughs> yeah, Ethereum. So guys, I I look. I can obviously talk about the prices. Um, Ethereum. What is Ethereum's price? Yeah, Bitcoin's moving forty nine nine. Look, at, I mean, that, I, I can't show you guys because obviously I don't have that. Um, so <laughs> by tomorrow night, pump starts back up Thursday morning. That would be was up. Uh, that would be was up. Uh, So Ethereum, you're down at yet under 1800, still under 1800. Wow. I mean, it just seems like with the whole NFT space, um, you guys, I'm not sure if you guys heard of NFTs. I mentioned it briefly. I mentioned it in the Patreon recently, how I believe there's some things going on in the NFT space. So you definitely want to stay up to date on that. But Ethereum is the backbone of DeFi, the backbone of DeFi. The road, he said, I just don't get why alts drop when the Bitcoin pumps. Well, here, um, so basically what you want to look at is the Bitcoin dominance. Bitcoin dominance is the reason why the alts are dropping. So you have the, so basically you have the entire, um, I'm just trying to think of how to visualize this. You have the entire pot of all the money. This is all the money that's in, you know, in the whole crypto space. Okay. Let's see if I have any cash in my wallet. So like, like you literally have like all this money. <laughs> how can I, I describe this? Okay, cool. So you, so you have like two twenty dollar, like you have two twenty dollar bills here. Okay, you got two twenties, and so Bitcoin is coming in. It's taken away from the alts. It's taken half. It's going to take fifty percent of the whole market share. Okay, since since Bitcoin's dominance is around sixty percent right now, let me. Uh, yeah, it is currently on CoinGecko. Says sixty percent. So basically, just to make this simple, it's going to take fifty percent. So it's going to take a whole twenty away from the alts. Now alts. Now they only have one twenty. All coins only have one twenty. They used to have two twenties. Now they only have 120. So Bitcoin came in and just stole stole the thunder. So that's um, very silly, very impromptu, probably not very descriptive. I do apologize. I just um, kind of just, it was my wall was right there. So I just thought I'd throw that out there. Um, if, if that explains it or doesn't, just let me know. Um, but basically, Bitcoin is taking the thunder away. Bitcoin's dominance was closer to 70% and it's fallen down to 60. So now I'm, I'm expecting a bounce back up. But if the dominance falls down lower, guess what? Guess what, guys? You know what's going to happen. Oh, those alts are going to go on fire. It's going to be crazy. Josh Jones, I converted a lot of my alts to the graph and ETH. Is this a good move? I just don't know how long I should be sitting on these. Hey, guess what, guys? I cannot tell you when to buy. I cannot tell you when to sell. I'm not a financial advisor. So all, like, all I say is you just got to make your own, like, your own uh, you know, like opinions, your own financial decisions, and go from there. Jonathan William, you said not 49.99. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. Let's see. What is the price? Bring up another one. It's kind of weird that I, I don't have the screen shared. It's kind of weird. It's kind of weird. And Giovanni said, I always thought it was because people are pumping money onto BTC. That's why alts are going down. Well, yeah, they're probably. So when Bitcoin dominance is going up, when Bitcoin's going up, they're probably taking profit from all coins. So they're taking the profit from their alts and then they're selling into Bitcoin. So they're stacking their Bitcoin. A lot of people, what they do is in order to increase their Bitcoin position, they just play with the alts, make money, convert it directly to Bitcoin. So that is what's up. And guys, just want to say we my, so my like my grandmother made this this Bitcoin thing back here. She's working on the graph symbol. She's working on the graph symbol. If you guys are interested, just let me know. It's I mean it's literally handmade, made in the USA. These things take time. She had like three, I think maybe four um different trials just to get it going. Yeah, Joe, patience. You need lots of patience. Yes, guys, patience is key. Patience is key for sure. You definitely don't want to miss out on those patience. It's where the gains are made, guys. It's where the gains are made. Keep in mind, with, like with DNT, I held that thing for three months and I made uh, percentage wise, it was, it, was, it was under a penny. I bought under a penny and I sold 
some uh, made some decent gains well over 40x. So just keep that in mind, guys. Keep that in mind. Patience will work out. Jonathan, you, I'm holding 11,000 ADA right now. I wonder what will happen if I hold all year. Ooh, on, on, only time will tell, right? <laughs> only time will tell. See how things work out. YouTube OG, what's up? We said, how can Bitcoin work worldwide as a world currency if the consumption of power is as much as Argentina if the whole world would use the power just to power? If the whole world uses Bitcoin to power just that too much, um, that whole argument with Bitcoin, the the whole, hey, it uses too much power. Like, what is going on there? Like, da 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 da. But nobody ever brings up the point: how much money does it cost to print dollars? How much money does it cost to make the coins? Like, look, we have a United States quarter here, we have a nickel here. How much money does it cost to mine these metals and produce them? And then to like, you look on the design there, so. How much money does it pay to pay somebody, if I get that focus, to make these designs on all these quarters? How, like, how much money is wasted with that? What is, you know, the environmental I impacts on the mining process of these metals? I mean, and not even to mention, like, you go look at a dollar bill, like like a 20 here or any kind of currency. What, like, what about these? Um, like, how is the environmental and, like, impact on these with the dying of the, like, of the paper? All that numbers, you can't actually get a good answer. You can't actually find a realistic answer. They love to hate on Bitcoin because of this. But at the end of the day, though, I think um, with, solar, with solar technology, you know, we have Elon Musk. Hey, Tesla, they just bought $1.5 billion worth of Bitcoin. Keep in mind, it wasn't Dogecoin. It wasn't the coin he pumps on, like on, on Twitter. It is Bitcoin. Bitcoin. Keep, keep that in mind. They just bought some good old Bitcoin, if you know what I mean. Um, but at the end of the day, though, let's see what will happen. With uh, the, the energy consumption, solar pa panels, I think solar panels, energy, some kind of, uh, with solar panels, uh, that kind of technology, I think it's going to exponentially be increased, be extremely more efficient throughout time. So that's something I am super excited to see, you know, e like Elon will probably make some sort of cr like crazy thing or something. And then with, with Bitcoin, you know, mining, I understand it's very power intensive. It's using more and more, um, you know, computer technology, you have to always upgrade your computers, which is a down downside to that as well. But it's also, but that's the part that makes the network so secure. That's the part that makes Bitcoin so valuable. So, you know, it's a double-edged sword. You have a high value because of it, but at the same time, it's using a lot of energy. But, but like I said, you can't even compare it. Like what, like what's it cost for this quarter to go mine the, all, like all the elements for that and then pay somebody to make the designs and then produce that. How, what's the environmental impact on that? I bet there is a lot of water wasted on these things. I, I, I can only imagine. Cool, let's catch up with the chat a little bit. We got uh, Jonathan, uh, you're holding a lot of uh, ADA. Hold it for your A, we'll see what happens. Uh, Josh says, let me rephrase, do you see graph rocketing? Oh, in the future, yes. This year I see it, yes. Right now we're consolidated. We are consolidated. Just relax, be patient, and uh, the show will continue. Just, just be patient. We have Tyler. You said the big pump will come when very high ETHs are solved. I don't know about that. Uh, I don't know if that's necessarily going to cause a pump. I mean, obviously, Ethereum 2.0 is coming. Um, Coinbase, you can sign up for the wait list to start participating in the staking for that. Um, but yeah, I'm not sure if that's necessarily going to solve it. ETHs have been a problem for a long time, even including the bear market. They were obviously down because of not everybody had uh, like was participating, like and all that lo like that lovely stuff in the bear market. But yeah, now things are crazy. We got um, Shin Jim, if I'm saying that right. You know, Algo, Cello, Ren, Adam on my mind. I mean, you got top players right there. You obviously have top players. You can't go wrong with any of them, um, in my humble opinion. I'm not a financial advisor, just a silly dude on the internet. But yeah, I mean, I'm definitely down for that. We have J, uh, Jail77, if I say that correctly. I know I butcher names. I do apologize. I'm just, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm only human half the time. So just keep that in mind. But so in five years, Bitcoin prediction, well, I recommend you go to look into Bitcoin.com, which you can go to the live stream earlier today. Check that out. We, we went over these charts. I'm pulling it up right now, but obviously you guys can't see. Because like I said, we're doing a different kind of live stream format. Let me know what you guys like. Do, do you guys need that screen there? Would you guys like me to have my laptop here and I can show you? Um, Just let me know. I, I, I just wanted to see how it works on the phone in case I'm ever out and about. And there's bam, and there, there's some banging news going on. I have to go live. You know what I mean? want to know what's going on here. So yeah, basically go to lookintobitcoin.com. So look into bitcoin.com. Earlier, um, we were going over the two-year MA multiplier. 
and you, and you're saying what's going to happen in uh, five years, I would recommend you go look into the stock to flow model on lookintobitcoin.com, which we've looked at before on this channel. So if anybody's new here, definitely consider smashing that subscribe button because you want to stay up to date on the latest in crypto space, don't you? So definitely tap that subscribe. And of course, guys, I appreciate those likes. I see we're at 10 likes. Thank you guys so much. I really do appreciate it. But um, <laughs> so get you a good smartphone to go live on. Yeah, I mean, I definitely have a good smartphone. I got the Galaxy Note 8 or Galaxy Note 9. I forget which one it is. But yeah, it's definitely good. I'm just not sure if I can show my screen. Not sure how that works. I know I can record and talk on my screen, but not sure with, not sure with uh, live. That That's kind of why I'm doing this. To see exactly how this works out. Just testing it out. And thank you guys so much for being here just to test this out. We're going to keep things going, you know what I mean? We're going with that. Bam. Okay, so yeah, basically, as I was saying, stock, like stock to flow. So five years from now, so right now we're in 2021. So 2026 is what you're calling for, is what you're asking for. Based off the stock to flow, we should either have already peaked or we're going to be around peaking time for the next parabolic move. So just keep that in mind. And let's see. So what, what what's my thought on Dogecoin? I mean, you can make a lot of bucks. You can make a lot of bucks off some Dogecoin. But guess what? Um, if uh, Elon pumps it and then it ends up getting dumped, you can also lose a lot of bucks. You could lose. Ooh, I, I'm not. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm messing with things here. You can also lose a lot of bucks. So please be careful with that. Yeah. So that's my thing about Dogecoin. I'm not really into it, but you can make some bucks. I mean, buying at the very low Dogecoin. Pff, it never hurt, right? It never hurt. So, YouTube OG, Silver needs to get mines for all the computers and solar panels and electronics off the future. If Elon was smart, that he would buy all the silver he can and he will need it. Yeah, I mean, but there's also possibility. Um, I, I've read articles like a year or two ago about possibly like somehow making silver in the lab. Like, guys, I, I do have a science background. Um, so, I, I do have a degree in, uh, you know, science. But they're possibly somehow making silver in the lab. I didn't fully understand it. And possibly Elon will be mining the, the moon for like the elements such as silver and gold. So that's why the scarcity of gold kind of makes me, eh, it, if he mines it there, it's not really scarce. And then somehow creating silver in the lab, interesting. But I do see your point. As of right now, he does need silver for all those to create the soil energy. That does make sense. I, I do get it. The road, what's your biggest bag, homie? Mine is XLM and DNC. My biggest bag would have to be Bitcoin, my homie. My, my biggest bag is Bitcoin. I'm super conservative. Um, I mean, I do have alts. Like, don't get me wrong. I have a, a boatload of alts. But my biggest bag by percentage is definitely Bitcoin. Long term, that's what it is. Get you a good smartphone to go live on. Yeah, got a Galaxy Note 8 or Note 9. I forget what it is. Yeah, I mean, it, it seems pretty good. Just not sure if I can sh like share my screen. I, I, I just want to do some in, like impromptu live stream like this. See how it works out. Uh, we got S11A88IR. GRT hold or sell? I'm personally holding it. Guys, we bought lot, we bought some GRT live on the live stream the other day. And I, I'm, I'm holding. I believe, I believe in the long term. I believe in the long term. If you guys um, want to see some great news that you say you missed the live stream, if you, if you missed the video from earlier today, definitely go check that out. There, there's some exciting news in the live live stream. There was also some exciting news in the video from today. So definitely go check those out. And of course, if anybody's new here, definitely smash that subscribe button. Just can't, you just can't miss it. Bam, you just don't want it red. So what else we got going on? We got Jack, hold on 1.5 BTC, sell a bit and buy other altcoins. Hey, I mean, that's a tough question, my homie. That is a tough question because what happens? Like what happens when Bitcoin takes off and alts dump or, 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 or this? Or what happens if you do it and then you make a lot of gains? Like what happens if you do it, you make a lot of gains? I mean, yeah, it worked out great, but it's come down to the timing. And uh, are you always able to sell? Are you always able to get that sell order in? Can you, you know, put in limit orders? Um, you guys know how to use pro coinbase it should be down in the description i don't know i don't know how to set things up oh yeah it looks like it is down in the description yeah go down there and check out the free video to save on terrible coinbase fees if you don't know how to do that definitely want to learn how to put limit orders in that that is crucial crucial so definitely consider doing that we have you guys i can't tell you tell you when to buy or sell i can't tell you tell you what to buy or sell but i get your point though if you have 1.5 bitcoin that's approximately 75 000 bucks right now 
if you would drop 25k into some alt and it and it triples in just a week i mean yeah sell everything put it right back into bitcoin but but in theory that sounds great but what if bitcoin also went up 2x that's why you got to look at the charts of that coin to bitcoin stop thinking usd stop thinking your local currency so that that's something to keep in mind what else is going on in the chat? I just want to thank everybody for tuning in. This is a totally different style kind of live stream. I appreciate everybody tuning in here right now. And if you're new here, consider smashing the subscribe button. And always that like button. It likes when you give it a good old smack. So m- moving on with the chats. We have, you know, you said, what do you think? What do you do with alts? Bitcoin don't behave alts. What do I do with the alts? I like to take profit from my alts, put in some Bitcoin or pull out in USD if, it, if I need that, like in person. Um, that's my personal thing. Crypto Greg, you hold Adam Cosmos. Yes, I got me a bag of atoms. Got me a bag of atoms, if you know what I mean. Back in the day. YouTube OG, is the future of Bitcoin microchips in the hand? If so, Bitcoin is, is the mar- is the mark of the beast. Um, I mean, I guess it's possible. Nobody knows for sure. But, but what I do like, though, is the QR codes. I do like how it's easy to transfer with QR codes. I think eventually we're going to somehow have addresses. Like, you know how right now the addresses are so long. They're so, like... You know, make sure everything is right because somebody could have um, put malware on your computer or some kind of virus that changes the address when you copy and paste. If you didn't know that, yes, you got to check everything. Be like very serious. Be very diligent. Like look at every letter, every number, which I know is a pain. Trust me, I understand. But I think the future, we're going to have like something like emails, something like emails. You're going to be able to pick your name. You know, like I could be like the crypto homies. Like I, I could say send, send whatever to the crypto homie and then be so easy to send. Which I know EOS has worked on that. I know there's other platforms that are doing that. Same thing like with unstoppable domains. Volume is low. I guess I gotta talk louder. I do apologize. Um, so I'll try to talk, talk like a little louder. But so with uh, yeah, so basically I think in the future. I mean, maybe down the road my, microchips, but we shall see. Why doesn't Coinbase add new coins anymore? They do. They're just very slow. They're very slow and very very picky. Giovanni said, I like watching the live feed with crypto news. Cheers, bro. Take it easy, my homie. Take it easy. Thank you for the p- feedback. I appreciate it. We got uh, Tyler. So Pancake Swap is, on, is the only place to get it right now. For uh, for Barry, as I you set them against some Barry on first. Hey, the thing is, uh, with, like, with stuff like that, that could actually work out. That could work out. Same time, it might not. So just be safe there. Just be safe. That's a high risk, high, high reward. Jonathan, if... If it if it was you, when would you put money into Bitcoin right now? Oh, that's such a hard question, my homie. That's such a hard question. Um, so I've been in. When would you put money into Bitcoin? I personally like the dollar cost average, to, 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 like to make it easy. Since the, like my number one thing with Bitcoin is just dollar cost averaging. This thing is going to work out over time. In my non financial advice opinion. This thing is going to be the thing of like the decade. I I highly believe Bitcoin will easily hit one million dollars one million dollars in this decade i firmly believe that i mean you have the fed just printing money like psh, 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 it's just going i mean they're literally just taking the printer and just it's just going like it's just going like they're, they're not stopping the printer the printer keeps going and inflation is coming inflation is coming homies i mean i go go to the grocery store they, like you're starting to notice certain things the same price but they they made the product smaller they made the product smaller. That is inflation. That's inflation right there. You know, you go out to eat and now it charges a little bit more. Guess what? That is inflation or the same price, but now they're, they're giving you smaller portions. That is inflation right there. It's, and it's, it's, it's that silent inflation that nobody sees. So I definitely could see a million dollar Bitcoin. And I, I like the dollar cost average Bitcoin. All time a little more, more pick, picky with. And Tyler said, thanks to you, you too. Hey, th- hey, thanks, man. Thank you for tuning in. We got Alex, volume is too low. Um, I'm not sure how to turn the volume up. I'm talking pretty loud. Um, so I guess I can try to talk louder. But le- like, let's continue. Said so Cell is working on that with QR codes and making it easier to mobile phones. Yeah, I mean, there's a bunch of projects working on that for sure. Yeah, it seems like there's a bunch of projects working on that, but who's going to actually make it happen? Who's going to actually make it happen and, 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 and like, make it good? So... Cell is working on that with yet. Yeah, so I, I can hear just fine on the weekends, on the weekends. 
Oh, so on, on the weekends, Bitcoin always seems to come down the weekends, especially Sundays. Yeah, we have seen we have seen uh like we have seen something ha like happen like that. Excuse me, like there are patterns. There are patterns for sure. Craig, seems volume on most crypto is down, or we maybe entered a bear market. Okay, I don't believe we're entering a bear market, guys. I've been first of all, I first notified the Patreon a couple days ago. I forget exactly, but I have to go in there and look about the whole. I do believe uh, a next thirty to forty percent correction is going to be incoming, and I, I'm I'm concerned. I, I'm concerned for the new people because all they've seen is four x, eight x, sixteen x gains. That's all they've seen. They haven't seen a correction. Trust me, when a correction comes, oh my! If you've been buying the top, your your heart your heart is gonna just sink. You, you, it's just gonna sink. It, it's gonna feel so bad. Like it's gonna feel terrible. And uh, yeah, I'm just concerned. I'm just concerned. So please be aware it's potentially going to happen. So I'm not saying it's gonna ha happen for sure, like tomorrow, next day. But just be prepared for the next uh, few months. It's gonna happen. Volume is good. A eh? was up. He said, uh, Simon. You said if I'm saying that right, I do apologize. Dude, what is happening to GRT? GRT is currently at. I have so many things open right here. I literally have three screens, so like, it just so many tabs, so much like everything. When I'm live, differently. Yeah, so one one ninety eight, one ninety eight. You yeah, guys, we're we're like we're consolidating. We are consolidating. I want to see us not drop below the. The one, the one, like a dollar eighty-seven, a dollar eighty-seven. I, I want to see us hold that. I want to see us hold that. If we don't hold that, then I expect us to fall down a little bit closer to a um, dollar sixty-three. So hopefully we can get that held. Uh, that would be very nice, obviously. So hopefully that happens. Yeah, that's a little update on the GRT. Um, we're definitely gonna have an update tomorrow on it. Definitely gonna have an update. And what do you guys think of this type of live stream? Do you guys like this? Do you guys not like this? Do you guys prefer the screen and then my small face? Um, like I said, I was just an improv to saw Bitcoin trying to go for all time high. Figured, hey, I just try this kind of live stream and go from there. We're still at forty nine thousand eight hundred and sixty seven bucks. So volume is okay. Hey, thoughts on Binance US? I I, I use Binance US. I like it because that's, I mean, <laughs> what, what, what what other choice do we have, homie? They took Binance.com away from us. They took it away. I loved it, homie. I loved it. And they just, they just took it away from us. They said, you can no longer use this because you live in America. And it's not Binance. It, it's regulations in the United States, which is, I mean, Binance.com is the best. If you're not an American and you're not using Binance.com, I don't know what you're doing, homie. I don't know what you're doing. I hope you get Binance.com. I just hope so. Because, yeah, it, it, it's frustrating. Yeah, Michael, we're just having a correction. Just a correction. Michael R., what is going on, homie? So nice to see you here. We got perfect Scotty Monero question mark. Monero? We haven't looked at Monero in a long time. Let me pull it up real quick on my computer door. XMR. So for $4.1 billion market cap with $233 right now. Guys, with these, it's weird with some of these privacy coins, because Monero is a privacy coin, if, if, if you're not aware. It's weird how like Coinbase lists some. They have Zcash and they have Dash, but then like they don't have Monero. I just find that strange. I find that strange. Anyways, Bitfinex hit BTC. It, it was on Binance. It's on Kraken, which is kind of weird. It's just, I don't know, I just find the whole privacy coins weird how they're very picky on listing them. But Coinbase is super picky in the first place. So, yeah, that that is that. We, we got Michael says 110 is strongest support. A let, let, Hopefully we hold it. Um, Shin, you said I'm buying Wednesday night. Alt pump hard last Thursday. I hope it works good for you. I hope that pattern works out, bro. I, I hope it does. Joe says emotional roller coaster. Yes, it's an emotional roller coaster. It's going to knock out the weak hands. It is going to knock out the weak hands for sure. We got R6 Ghost. How much do you think PayPal payments will boost the price of coins they will use? Uh, I mean, I wouldn't be surprised if it boosts a lot. See, what from my perspective, from my, from, from my research, it seems like they're going to have to buy the coins. Like they're going to have to stack up on the coins so they have liquidity. That's from, or or they're going to have to have a market maker, or, or they're going to have to have some kind of like market maker where they have some kind of liquidity pool. And that's where, guess what? Guess what? That's where DeFi comes in. That's where DeFi can come in. It can kind of be like a Uniswap, which would be kind of weird, though, because PayPal is centralized and Uniswap's not. So I doubt they want to decentralize their liquidity. That wouldn't make any sense, would it? No, I don't think so, Brent. I, I, like, I don't think so. So 
Yeah, I mean, we'll see. I wouldn't be surprised if it pumps it, but I also think they're going to be buying OTC over the counter. And then that right there doesn't pump the price. So it's just like with Tesla buying Bitcoin. Tesla didn't just go buy Bitcoin on Coinbase. They didn't just do that. They bought OTC. At least I'm assuming they bought OTC because why would they not buy OTC? Because if they just put a, or they had to buy small orders over the period of the month. Because if they literally just put a $1.5 billion market order in, um, the price of Bitcoin is going up a lot. And they're going to have a huge spread, a huge spread. And they, they don't want that. Michael says, GRT is on sale. Don't worry, DNT is good too. Yeah, love me some good old DNT if you know what I mean. We got, uh, Michael said, over three bucks. So one tells, tends the lowest end to the moon, over three bucks. Oh yeah, over three bucks for sure, over three bucks. And Brother Free, I cannot talk about that on the live stream. The YouTube algo will like, that's a major red flag. Um, I cannot talk about that. Javon, you said GRT is pretty good. Relax, guys. Yeah, just take it easy. Michael says 10 years from now, you will wish you bought GRT for $2. I love it. I love I love the patient that the people that are patient. I love it. Uh, we got Michael, it's 110. Yeah, bro, we lit. Hey, we lit from Island Zero. Silent M, what's going on, man? Hey, so which chart do you use to follow Mars? Um, yeah, so I saw that Elon um, said something about the Mars coin, but did they actually create it? Did they can, like can someone send me a DM on Twitter? Like, did they actually create it? And I do apologize. I'm I'm way behind on the DMs on Twitter. Way behind on the DMs on, like like on Instagram, guys. I, I'm I'm flooded with messages. I truly, truly, truly appreciate you guys messaging me, but I just don't have enough time time to get back. I will get back as soon as I can, as soon as I can. So I, I do apologize. Like I do apologize about that. If somebody can send me a DM about the like that, if it's actually out, because I don't know. I, I don't know. We got Alex Pancake is on fire. Yeah, I mean, pff, we've been talking about that since it's been like two dollars. I mean, wow, this thing's going amazing. It is amazing. And let's keep, I got to get caught up with the chat. Perfect, Scotty. Coinbase to me is good, but they don't have all the coins. Exactly. Use Binance or Binance US. Aeroflex. The whole market already started correcting. Sometimes Bitcoin starts first to correct, or otherwise all coins. Even though Bitcoin is going up, a lot of coins are starting their correction. I mean, we, we saw that today in today's live stream. We saw that earlier, like on the live stream earlier, the one that crashed and the second one. A lot of things are making higher lows. At least we're hoping it's higher lows. And Bitcoin will follow. Michael said, just as you wish you bought it at eight cents a few months ago. Yeah, I mean, buying, buying, guys, we mentioned GRT under 14 cents on this channel. We mentioned under 14 cents. So definitely smash that subscribe button so you can stay up to date on the latest in the crypto space. Michael, thank you. Hey, thank you so much for tuning in. You also said super cool that you reread comments. Just saying super cool. Like we are here to chat with you, not just each other. Helps a lot. Hey, that's what I'm, I kind of utilize the live streams for. I like interacting with everybody. Now, don't get me wrong, though. Don't get me wrong. I cannot get to every single chat. Like I can't answer everything. I do my best, though. I definitely do my best. So uh, no offense if I didn't get to it. And uh, we got JD2105, new cipher starting to climb. Let me just take a peek at some good old new cipher. Yeah, Brother Free, I, I can't talk about that. I do apologize. YouTube algorithm, red flag, I can get banned for that. But, but thank you guys so much for, for tuning in. I just wanted to pull up new cipher real quick because Bitcoin's currently at 49.5, so it's down a little bit. Um, every time like, I go live, it's weird. Every time it looks like it's about to break a new all-time high, so I go live ready for it, it doesn't break. It's like, ah, just kidding, just kidding. Got you. It's like a, like a little kid playing a silly joke. So new cipher at 74 cents. Oh, this is good. This is what we wanted to see. You're right. You said it's starting to climb. Yes, you are right, my homie. This is beautiful. This is what I like to see. And look at that. Let's... uh. Yes, yes, we yes, th this is good. Let's continue ma making the higher highs though. It's looking good right now. Let's continue. Bam, you said, uh, how about Civic? And we got Solomon. Hey, homies, dude, it's a real thing since like 2013. I'm not sure what you mean by from 2013, but Civic, the good old Civics. My little touch up on that. Just a quick, uh, quick look at the TA 42 cents. Okay, so we're still in that down, the downtrend. We don't want to, we, ooh, I mean, I'm getting a little concerned. We definitely do not want to get down to 41 cents. We do not want that to happen unless it's a double bottom. That would, that'd be great. But I see this little pattern of us falling down lower and I don't like that. I would like to see us break out and make some higher highs. 
That's just a quick look. Parsa, hey homie, hey, what's going on? So nice to see you here. We got Rambo, like Lambo. Rambo B, do you buy low using limits or use notifications and then buy it at or near the market price? I mean, I, I do like using limit orders. I do do that occasionally. But um, I mean, like, I don't always have money to put in there just to sit there and wait. So sometimes I just have to have just be there at the right time. So uh, alerts would, would be great. But I prefer to use limits if I have the money. Silent M, I'm panicking to buy now. FOMO is real. Over Doge. <laughs> Oh no, oh no, oh no, man. You're making me hurt a little bit here. You said over Doge. I have the app and I'm trying to buy now. I just can't figure out the chart to, to, to think it's a, it's great. I can't figure out the chart to look. I think it's the Mar. Wait, Mars USDT? So, so Elon's coin's already out? Elon's coin is already out? Interesting. Like I said, if, if his coin's already out, somebody send me a DM. Somebody send me a DM on the tweeters. Um, I'm going to see what's going on there. Ooh, what did I just do? Anyways, yeah. So if you said, so Mars slash USD, let me, I mean, I see there is a Mars. I don't know if that's Elon's coin. Oh my. Don't tell me this is his coin. <laughs> no, it's been out for a while. Uh, actually from the 15th. I guess it could be his coin. Interesting. No, I'm sorry. I apologize. I was wrong. From the 12th of January. From the 12th of January. So I uh, probably not his. I mean, I guess it's possible. Mars coin. I love it. I say it's a real thing. Parsa says, are you buying more Loom in this dip? Guys, like the live stream. It helps the channel. Thank you so much, Parsa. Am I buying more Loom? I already got my nice bag of Loom. I already got a good bag of Loom. Got in at a pretty good price. Way, actually, way below. What's it at right now? Because I probably got in um, lower. <laughs> How can Mars coin go to the moon? I don't know. Isn't that technically falling down? <laughs> yeah, Loom's at 10.7 cents. I actually got in a little bit lower than that. Got in a little bit lower. So I'm... uh. I'm just hold, holding with that bag. You guys just got to get that heated blanket on. It's pretty cold in the room that I film in. Very bad insulation. So we're going to get uh, that heated blanket on real quick. Okay, we all good now. Let's get these get this chat going. It's so nice to see everybody in here. Th thank you guys for tuning in. This is completely different. Impromptu live stream. So that's what's up. I really appreciate you all hanging in here. How, having a good time with the crypto homie. So so let's just continue with these chats. Uh, Michael, any coin will sky, skyrocket once everyone knows about it. <laughs> Basically, I love it. Basically, um, I see, is crypto, know me if I'm saying that right, is he in the uh, the Discord? I mean, in the live right now? Because he sent me a link, so I'm assuming that may, may be the Mars. I'm going to check that out in the background real quick. I can't even tell. Was that on Twitter or was that on Discord? Oh, Mars Coin. Yes, you did send it to me. Thank you so much, Crypto. Know me if I'm saying that right? I do apologize. I'm terrible with names. Mars Coin is mooning. It's up 1,000% after Elon Musk shout out. Oh, my goodness. Uh, and it's Twitter. Oh, my goodness. This is crazy. This is. I'm going to mute, mute my phone so you guys don't hear all the notifications. Thank you so much, my homie. Thank you so much. I really appreciate that. Whoa. So Mars coin is booming. I was looking at the wrong coin though. What exactly is the ticker? Mars coin. Up a thousand percent. That is crazy. Yeah, it's literally up 1,700%. That is insane. That is insane, guys. Crazy gains were made. Crazy gains. You guys, if, if you're just tuning in here, and thank you so much, my homie. Thank you so much for that. Um, it, like, if you're just tuning in here, oops, got rid of that. We're doing a different type of live stream today. I just want to thank everybody for tuning in. Uh, you know, let me know your feedback. Do you guys like these kind of impromptus? Do you guys like where I share the screen? I feel like the sharing the screen is probably better. But at the same time, I just want to test this out. Just want to test it out. Um, we got. It looks like you're asking me if, it, if, it, if it's looked like it's consolidating. I didn't even check the chart, bro. I just know it's it's up almost 2,000% in the last 24 hours. I mean, it, it's uh, 
it's gonna be hard to see it's very hard to do some technical analysis on that because it's just so parabolic i mean that's that's so parabolic i would expect a pullback but there is no mark cap here and it doesn't even show supply like it's just it looks kind of like fishy just saying just saying it's only on two exchanges on oh they have their wallet there um wow wow where where to buy mars card I, I don't like FOMO into it. I do not like FOMO into these things. I just don't like that. Um, I would be very careful. It says decentralized humanity. Did Elon actually make this coin? Like, is this actually made by Elon? That would be insane. It's only on two exchanges, though. It's only on two exchanges right now. More exchanges coming. It says, well, just be safe, guys. Please be safe. Um, this could have a, have a massive dump. I don't want to see you guys lose, lose a lot of money. I don't want to see that, okay? So just be safe out there, and like just be careful. Let like let's go. Um, Pancake Swap AM. What is going on? Pancake Swap it is mighty fine. It's doing pretty good. Uh, wait till the Doge people move over. Talk about incoming pump. <laughs> only Robinhood lists it, right? Only Robinhood lists it. So Jeff says, "Also, you're back." Hey, thanks so much for tuning in. Brother Free says, "Dogecoin." Um, yeah, Dogecoin. Lol. I know it's it's funny. And Michael brings up a good point. How can Mars go to the moon? I know it's like going down. Like, wouldn't it go down like negative a thousand percent? We got crypto bullion stocks, uh, stock predictions. So you guys want to know about stocks? You guys want to know about some stocks? Um, I have a homie that's been working on stocks and forex stuff. Um, I can post his channel in the in, in the chat if you guys are interested in checking it out. I don't know much about stocks, man. I, obviously, I know a little bit. I mean, I know basics, but I'm not like a you know, looking at this stuff all the time. You guys want to know more about stocks, more about Forex, stuff like that. Here, I'm pulling up his channel right now. He's pretty new to YouTube. You guys should check him out. You guys should check him out. I know when you're starting, it's it's uh, it, it's very hard, you know, because you not many people watch your videos. But uh, he's going to, he, he's working on it. Let me pull this video up. Bam, right here. We're gonna get that channel in here. Cool. Hey guys, if you're in, in, interested in stocks, definitely go check out the my Mike My One Homies channel. De like definitely go check that out. Um we have yeah, how can Mars coin go to moon? I don't know, it's like going down. And Austin, you're back. Thank you guys so much. And stock predictions, like I said, check out that link. Where, where can you buy it? Where can we buy what? Mars? It's only on, uh, well, you may, you may have to go to Mars. You may have to go call Elon. Hey, Elon, uh, can I get a ship to Mars? I want to buy that Mars coin. No, it's on XT.com and find Xbox. There's a Bitcoin pair and a USDC pair. So interesting. I just think it's probably a liquidity thing that pumped it. So just be safe. Yeah. Dino L. Ray says the Elon tweet. Yep. Alex would be smart for Coinbase to list ADA and or DOT. Hey, we shall see. Jim said only 50K volume. Yeah, that's that's what worries me. Jim, Jim Pearson, guys, he brings up a great point. He brings up a great point. Only 50K volume. And now he retired on, 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 like only 60K. So it seems like it's going up. <laughs> Underground music box. Bitcoin or Lotto? Bitcoin. I mean, I'm not a financial advisor. I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm just a silly dude on the internet. But yeah, Bitcoin. Bitcoin for sure. It says you can mine Mars coin if you own a Tesla phone. <laughs> I love it. I love it. <laughs> you crack me up. I did not invest in Lotto in, in 2009. Uh-oh. Should, should we buy? Hey, MA, let's not let's not spam the chat. Should we buy Ave now? Hey, I cannot tell you when to buy. I cannot tell you when to buy. Jim, now you're saying 60K volume. James said sub that sub that homie last time you mentioned him. Hey, good stuff. Hey, what's up? You guys, anybody who's new here, definitely consider subscribing. Um, can I hear, just have some feedback? Do you like just the one-on-one -on -one chat right here where we're just chatting about stuff and I have the computer in the background where I'm looking and just talking? You guys like that? Or do you guys prefer if I share the screen? What's going on there? Just like to hear hear your feedback because I figure, you know, one day I'll be out, out and about and stuff something happens and I got to go live. So we'll probably have one of these in, 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 like in the future. Check the Tesla ad. That's real Tesla ad. Let's do Tesla see what pops up <laughs> there would be a mars coin that is crazy if he's actually behind this 
he's planning for an extraterrestrial cryptocurrency. I mean, I believe it, like aliens are real. I mean, who here believes aliens are real? I mean, I definitely believe they are. But uh, this is interesting. Share the screen and, and analysis. Yeah, how can I... Um, here, I'm just trying to Google. How to share screen on YouTube Live. On, on mobile... YouTube live. I'm literally Googling a question live, guys. This is real. Like, this is authentic content, homies. Um, how to share Android screen. Yeah, I, I definitely need to look at that. Can I share the link? Yes, I can share the link, my homie. That you're on now. Um, the one, So not the one you sent me. I can share you. This is the one for Mars coin, guys. I'll put this. Maybe, maybe, maybe this is what you mean, my homie. I'll put this here. That's for the Mars coin. I prefer the screen too, but you, but you should definitely mix it up. No, I definitely think you guys will prefer the uh, that like definitely prefer the screen. But if but uh, you know if I'm not able to get that up, um, yeah, I, I I totally get it. Elon Musk is an alien. <laughs> Be careful. I think crypto is alien money, and no, nobody understands it yet. <laughs> I love it. Zachary's holding a new cipher for a long time. A your your holder. A hanging in there strong. Bitcoin is the future. I totally agree. I totally agree. The Tesla Moon, the okay, so the, the Tesla Moon article. Um, I didn't actually click on it, I just Googled it. But yeah, so this is the title one that, that I just read. Let me paste that. Hey, bro, I'll send this. And hopefully that helps out, homie. Um, I would not buy that dumper. Yeah, I, would, I don't like to buy tops. I don't like to buy tops. Tops are not cool. Tops are not cool. Um, Michael said, where where were you with Bitcoin in 2009? The secret is simply to buy before everyone else knows. I mean, exactly. Definitely buy before everybody else knows. The odds are, though, the odds are if you bought back then, you probably lost it. You probably lost it. So just keep that in mind. Um, we got Sean. Would you be willing to sell your new Saphir cost to pick up an extra Saphir cost? I'm not sure what that is. Do you pick up extra GRT at a lower cost? I'm not sure what Saphir means. Saphir. I'm going to have to Google that. Yeah, I'm not sure what that means, my homie. But guys, just thank you guys so much for tuning in. I, I know these are completely different. Like, this is a completely different kind of live stream. We have 62 homies in here. Thank you guys so much. Um, I, I really do appreciate it. New Cypher? Hey, we got interest in New Cypher. New, new. Yes, voice text isn't the best. I got you, I got you. Yeah, I'm definitely bullish on New Cypher, guys. We talked about that a little bit. If I'm not mistaken, we're still above uh, like the set, set like 73. I, I want to like, see it stay there. What's the current price? Current price in New Cypher. Damn. Wow, I, I can't find it. And you? Oh, it's because it's organized differently. Yeah, 74 cents. It keeps rising. That's what I, I want to see. That's what I want to see. Blunt Steps said he means sell your new cipher for GT. I'm not telling you guys to sell or buy. I'm not telling you to sell or buy. You guys have to make that up for yourself. But uh, Yuri H, you have a very good question. Very good question. Will I ever sell my Bitcoin? Will I ever sell my Bitcoin? I don't know about that. I, mean, I don't know. That's uh there's only so many Satoshis. There's only so many Satoshis out there. Just keep that out. 21 million total. That's it. And oh my, oh my. I don't know. Jim said, uh, wait, so we got he means sell your new cipher for GRT. Oh, Saphir. So new cipher. Oh, I, I got you, I got you. Um, I'm not sure if I could do that. I'm I, I'm not sure. Like they're both solid projects. Cody said, "I told my wife ten years ago that my girlfriend and I was going to invest in Bitcoin. Nobody knew what it was. I never did it and regret it. Yeah, I mean, hey, you, you 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 like you live and learn, homie. You live and learn. You live and learn. Go from there. Mars Coin has been around since 2014, but now Elon's pumping it. Oh my, oh my. Crypto Life District on Coinbase seems." Way under value after researching, definitely want to look at DNT, DNT, DNT. Yes, guys, we mentioned that coin on this channel when it was under a penny. Under a penny. It was less than a nickel. You see the nickel right here is less than that. 
it was it was a fraction. It was one. It was less than one fifth of this nickel. So it was pretty freaking amazing. We got it. We bought low. We took it some massive gains. That's how we like to do it. Sean says new cipher versus GRT. Which one has more potential? Uh, I mean, I guess I have to go GRT right now. I have to go GRT, but like I said, non-financial advice. John says, what do you think of ETH? Super duper bullish on Ethereum. Super bullish. But I'm just some silly dude on the internet, right? What do I know? Just a silly dude. Whoa, 48 smash of the likes. Thank you guys so much. I really, really do appreciate it. It helps the YouTube algo. I do appreciate it. We got Moonshadow, what's up? Hey, homie, things are being uncertain recently. Only time will tell. Yes, things are. I'm, I am expecting further price action to the downside. I do expect further price action to the downside. So please be careful with that. Be careful. Um, we shall see how things work out. What was your thoughts on this Abe dip? Buy low, sell high. Buy low, sell high. That's all, all I have to say. And Michael, you agree with Crypto Life that DNT is underrated? Hey, I mean, hey. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna go against that. I definitely I I agree. Let's put it that way. Zach says I bought both early on, so I love them both. Gear 2 is probably the better project that but New Cypher hasn't pumped up as high. Yeah, I mean, but like with New Cypher, I have the chart right here. It looks like it's about as long as we can hold this on the daily, things are about to look good. We're starting the daily good. So I, I hope this works out. Sean Jimmy says, I sold my DNT like an idiot. I already kicked myself. I mean, did you make profit? Did you make profit? Did you make those gains? Homie, you make those gains. Make those, make those quarters. Make you did did you turn your DNT? Did you sell for a quarter a piece? Because sounds good. Uh Jim said possible quick flash crash soon beware, but will be bought up quick. I mean, I wouldn't be surprised. I, I wouldn't be surprised. You said yes, but still, dot dot dot. Homie, don't get upset about taking profit, my man. Don't get upset. Um, if you guys want to know, like, like what's inside my brain, guys, I started that Patreon right there. The Patreon down below, when I buy, when I sell, just get some tidbits of what's going on in my brain day-to-day -day basis. Um, when I see a hidden gem, that, that gets launched there. I take screenshots of, of my portfolio. Um, I let, like, as time's going on, we're t I'm, I'm slowly taking more of them. So just keep that in mind. Keep that in mind. Um, yeah, so taking profit never hurts. Yet, yeah, as Michael said, guys, go check out Michael's comment. Michael says... Taking profit is never an idiotic move. Taking profit is profit. You made money. Move on. Make money somewhere else. Because it because it sounds like so. What happens is, what happens is, people they get caught up on the oh my goodness, you know I sold it at X price. Now it's X price times three. Oh, I could have made all these gains. No, no, no. But guess what? Guess what? Don't look at it like that. Look at taking that money, put it somewhere else, and make money. I got a lot of hate. For telling you guys, for 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 telling you guys to consider taking profit when GRT is around two dollars and fifty cents, two dollars and thirty cents. But guess what? Guess what? Look what happened. Just look what happened. And we got trade invested. I agree. At least partial profit. Yes, taking profit doesn't mean you sell one hundred percent. Doesn't mean you sell one hundred percent. But uh, crypto nomi, I do see your comments. I do see your comments. You're just taking some money off the table. A great way to start is just taking your initial investment out of the table. Take your, your initial investment off the table. That is a great way to do that. Keep that in mind. A great way to do that, okay? So just keep keep like, keep like that in mind. You know, Just be safe there. See what happens. Let's pull the chat up. It's cool how it disappears and, and, like, and goes away. So we have uh, taking profit is never an idiot move. Definitely not. BitTorrent is the next to pop. Ooh, I'd love to see that. Cody says, I hope we don't flash crash soon. I'm about to work out, and I've been watching BTC all day. Hey, dude, go take your workout. Bitcoin will move up and down. You just get like, like just get the workout in. We got uh, Shin, you said there would be more gains. <laughs> but you're focusing on that. You're focusing on that. you got to find the next opportunity. There's always another opportunity, guys. Always another opportunity. Keep that in mind. We, got, we have uh, William said, what do you think about synthetics? I'm bullish. I'm bullish. Excuse me, guys. Bullish on synthetics. Do you guys like synthetics? And I, I just want to give a shout out to all the Patreon supporters. Thank you guys so much. It really does help keep these live streams going, the, the daily content. I really do appreciate it. We're uh, it, we're going on fire there, guys. Keep, just keep my daily content there as well. Of course, it's going to be on, on the YouTubes as well. So just keep that in mind. What's my take on Algo? It's a solid product. I like that I can stake it. 
Shim says, I hear good things, but why? Good, like, good things about what? Good things about what? You know, I never even posted this on the tweeters. Never even posted this on the tweeters. And we're still 73 homies strong. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. All about synthetics. I mean, it's a, it's a decent player out there. We got trade and invest. Any thoughts on new cipher? One green while a lot of others still holding lagging behind. I'm I'm holding new cipher. You think maybe because it uh is low mark cap. I mean it's on the lower side, not super low, but I did I had I have the, I still have the chart up. I still have the chart up right here. Guys, this is looking good. Right now it's looking good. We're back up at uh 70, basically 75 cents. We, we want to continue to go up higher. I want to see us end up breaking that extreme high all the way up here at 86 cents like with the bodies, but if we could get above 78 cents, that would make me a little more comfortable. I'd be a little more comfortable. Let me pull up the, let me pull something up real quick. So basically when I look at the fibs, I'm seeing, uh, yeah, we're getting rejected right now at the 50, at the 0.5, which is about 75 cents. And then the, the, like the next stop is definitely getting past the 328. We definitely want to get past that. But things are looking good, though. Things are start, starting to bounce back. Eddie, what is going on, homie? You said my take on loopering. I'm bullish on loopering. Bullish. I, I, like that. I like the decks. We shall see how it works out, though. Alex says stack cakes, stack cake, earn cake, repeat. I love it. I love it. Pancake swap. A. Hey. We got William. Do you think Ave will retrace down to three hundred dollars? I mean, that's where my like worst case scenario is. Yes, worst case scenario. Jim says short term bullish exhaustion on Bitcoin. I mean, it's possible. What is the Bitcoin price doing right now? I mean, we're currently at forty nine four. I mean, it's just playing around. It's just playing around. We have uh, Michael's. Any take on the weird alt known as G O L U M? Um, let me see. Let me see if I have ever heard of that before. Because sometimes. Cool. G O L U M. I don't even see it on Coin Gecko. Let's check out Coin Mark Cap. Now I I don't know anything about that. I don't even, I can't even like find it here on Coin Mark Cap. We got Hannah hanging on tight across the board. When do you think we'll start seeing green again? Yeah, you probably mean Golem, Michael. Is probably what I'm thinking. Um, but start seeing some green again in, in the crypto space. Um, so if you missed the live stream from earlier, the two from earlier because the one crashed. Um, we went over um, possible, possibly places where we we'll see correction, possible correction, move, like movements. Expect to see a uh, possibly you no know, thirty to four percent correction, you know, in the next month or two, or maybe even sooner in in the crypto space. I wouldn't be surprised to see that happening, simply because back in twenty seventeen, back in twenty seventeen, we've had that about seven or nine times. We've had thirty to forty percent corrections in the crypto space. So just keep that in mind. Keep that in mind. Um, it's just how it works, guys. It's just how it works. Don't be afraid. Why, why, when this happens, I just want you to be prepared. I just want you to be prepared. I don't want you freaking out, worried, you know, selling the dip and buying the top. You don't want to do that. Michael, you said, oh, you meant Golem. Golem, yes. I mean, Golem's on, uh, yeah, no, it's no worries, my homie. It's no worries. I get it. autocorrect with, with uh, crypto words happens all the time to me. It's always saying the wrong thing. It's like, oh, come on, autocorrect. I got to turn that off. But so with Golem, I mean, it's cool how they're doing the, the that, that's on the CPU, if I'm not mistaken. Because I know render, or that GPU, because I don't know storage is with, with hard, hard drive space. I think I'm getting two of them confused. Um, well, let me pull it up real quick. Because render is probably the, so GNT or GLM. It's weird, they had, they had the blockchain migration, but not all places participated so it's like what is going on yeah so this is the just dist distributed computing that's right because render is the gpu power if i'm not mistaken which i think is very similar really cool definitely just check that out yeah gnt to glm live yeah but why hasn't coinbase done it i don't know um uh, we have jb you said uh i took my initial ave at 520 after buying at 144 congratulations congrats to you Playing with half his money now, but thinking of moving into ETH to increase my position there or to keep an Ave. Hey, def uh, definitely two solid players. Definitely two solid players. You cannot go wrong with either or. I can't tell you what to buy, though. I cannot tell you what to buy. 
And we got Jim ETH will correct to 1280. Remember this hat. Hey, I mean, I would love to buy a 1280 ETH. I would love a big correction. I'm not going to lie. I get it, though. A lot of people don't want to hear that. A lot of people don't want to hear that. They want big old Bitcoin in the background to go to the moon. Want to go to the moon. But uh, guys, we're, we're going to have corrections. Cri Crypto Cash, one Harmony Thoughts. It's definitely a solid project. I saw that it's on Binance US. Um, I was about to pick some up. But I uh, didn't pull a trigger. Only have so much money. Only have only have so many George Washington quarters to, to buy with, if you know what I mean. So going from there. I cannot believe it's been one hour, guys. It's been one hour. I just want to thank everybody for tuning in. The, the crypto only has to get going soon. Though. We got got we got to get going soon. Just put in your comments uh what like what's going on? What uh you know any last minute comments? Uh, I'd love some feedback. Do you guys like this where it's just my face? Do you guys want the screen up? Um, I get it. Pro probably the screen is probably going to be mo most popular, but I still want feedback. I, I love the good. I love the bad. Just let me know. Let me know. And I do apologize. I'm way behind on responses in, in my DMs. So I will respond as soon as I can. As soon as I can. I and we have Trade Invest. I feel like UMA is super cheap right now at 24 bucks with recent highs of 44 I mean, that's definitely a nice, a nice, um, a nice like, withdrawal. And Moonshadow hit some music. Yes, I still have to figure out the whole copyright but yes music is definitely a must music is something i must work on post the chart post, yes yeah, somehow get, get in the chart up i love it and we so post so we, de we definitely it's better with charts un understood stream beats so i should check that out we got hannah says love learning to read the charts a look to read the graphs yeah charts graphs same thing i got gotcha. you um but yeah just thank you guys so so like so much for the feedback i definitely um am going to be definitely doing the regular kind of live streams Keep in mind, I will definitely be doing that because showing you guys the chart, showing you what I'm looking at is probably a better option. I just saw it was, it was going live to figure, you know what? I never gone live on my phone before. So may, may do this some more. I'm starting a new job next week, guys. So I live streams are probably going to be less. I'm going to have more videos. But uh, possibly when I'm on break, possibly I could do live streams like this. So keep that in mind. This is all free music, no copyright issues on Stream Beats. Stream Beats, I got, I got to check that out. I think I saw that on TubeBuddy. So we'll keep that in mind. We got XPigs at Queen A was up. We got Bitcoin, Ethereum, XRP are the only ones guaranteed to go up. Uh, not not necessarily though. I don't think anything's guaranteed. John says congrats. Hey, thank you so much for tuning in. Ru uh, Ruben Penna said keep showing us when to expect parabolic moves. Hey, hey, I'm I'm right sometimes. I'm wrong sometimes. So keep that in mind. I'm right and I'm wrong. Uh, I, I I I do make mistakes. I'm I, like I'm only human. We have ADA will move. I love me some ADA. You have a nice forehead. Oh, thanks, bro. I, I appreciate it, my homie. I appreciate it. <laughs> but yeah, it says, don't forget about checking out Lightstream. Lightstream. Let me Google that. Lightstream. So that's probably for the phone, maybe. It looks like it's actually an internet company. I did upgrade. I did upgrade the internet. <laughs> William Thompson, Adam, going to 100 by the end of the year. Well, Stargate, we're going to the moon. No, I don't know. I mean, it, it would be cool to see. It would be cool to see. Jim said Bitcoin Ethereum might follow the Doge rising wedge pattern and break down and test major support. It's possible. It's possible. It's possible, guys. <laughs> uh, right at 10 bucks. That would be that. That that would be cool. But guys, the crypto only has to get going. I appreciate every single one of you guys tuning in. I really, really do. DNT to 75 cents. Oh, I love that. I love that. Anyways, I, I appreciate you guys tuning in. I really, really do. Have a great rest of your day, morning, afternoon, wherever you're from. Definitely consider smashing that subscribe button if you have not already. And of course, smashing that like button. I mean, come on, that, that like button. Nice little smack. And we got the Patreon down there. We got that list down there. Your free template down there. And free video on how to save on terrible Coinbase fees. So thank you guys so much for tuning in. We got we got a, like a lot of thanks, a lot of love right back at you, homies. Thank you guys so much. And we have a good luck on the new jobby. Thank you, my man. I appreciate it. We may have to do some like like ten or twenty minute live streams on break like this. So I I appreciate it. I hope you guys have a great day. And until next time, the crypto homie catch you in the next one. Bye bye. So this is, <laughs> how do I end it on the phone this time? <laughs> Maybe it's like that.